as my favorite. And, and we, I saw that because uh, you're actually painting something that's going to go out in October. No, August. August, yes, right? yes, yes. What, what, what is that? Well, so, event. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm having our art show uh, August 2nd. And, uh, it's my birthday, by the way. Happy birthday, pre happy birthday. Um, <laughs> Donate. <laughs> I don't know. That's part of the It's not a bromance. Hey. He said it's his birthday. I'm not gonna not get that one for his birthday. What? Yeah. Herpy birthday? Herpy <laughs> birthday. Herpy birthday. <laughs> we don't want those. No herpy birthdays. But um, no, yeah, I'm having an art show. August. Uh, August. Yes, yes, we're doing our job, guys. It's hey. kicking in. It's kicking in. You're right. August second, I'm having an art show. And um, I'm gonna have some prints on my photography, but I'm gonna have a lot of paintings. Like that's what I'm focusing on. Okay. And so. So you're bringing both of your skills yeah, together. Okay. But, but I want my paintings to be like the. The, the showcase. Focus. Yeah. Okay. Have you done art shows before? Yeah. Okay. I've done, I've done five or six. Okay. I don't even know anymore, but it's been two years since I've done my last one. Okay. So this is. This is kind of like a nervous kind of thing yeah. because now I know my style is different and everything's. So you like went into a two-year hiatus. Yeah, it's pretty I much. I, I see where you're going. I, I, like I, like I see what you do. There you go. I'm listening. Are you happy now? I get. Yeah, I'm getting there. <laughs> I'm drinking too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, I'm over here wiping shit too. <laughs> yeah, it's really, yeah, it's adapting to my life. Yes. Yeah, We're gonna be real pros, man. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. So, so dumb. Now, if you see our first video, like, I was, like, very broke. I tell you, I got drunk real quick, like, real quick. No, it's all good. Because it was the nervousness, yeah. and I was over here manhandling him. Like, oh, yeah. He, At this point, I'm buzzing. I'm like, like oh. I'm not going to lie. I'm like, I'm feeling good. I'm like, she was beating up on him. He's like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, it was cringe. A lot of very, a lot of cringe words. So moments brutal, in that so You mean chest bump? Yeah. Out of the frame. He's like, oh. <laughs> but, yeah. No, but, um. August second. So check out my Instagram up, at Jexy Studios. The okay, link is gonna go. be there. You can buy a ticket, and um, any ticket that you buy now goes towards my booth space because uh, it, it. What does that mean? So even though the art show is is being taken place by someone, like they're they are, are renting out the entire space, and then we rent our section. Okay. okay. Kind so of like market yeah. Sort of deal? So okay. um, I still have to pay for for my particular section. So any. Anyone that buys a ticket, it goes towards that, and then I just pay off the rest. So, um, obviously, you buying a ticket means a lot to me because it means you support what I do, and you're helping me out with my booth space. The opportunity to showcase. Correct. Right. And so, excuse me. And so then, um, yes. I'm gonna have my, my <laughs> And so you're gonna have uh, you're gonna be able to buy my paintings okay. there on the spot, like just. Boom, that's the one that-, that For I example, for that event, about how many pieces of art do you, would you be ready to expose? So, I heard for this particular show, the the space is gonna be six by six. So, um, I'm gonna have to strategize on how many pieces. Okay. I'm gonna take as many as I can, and then I'm gonna hang up my top pieces right, first. Right, right. And- See how you can work it out. And, and so, whatever yeah, fits there, the and then I'll just progress from there. But, um, yeah, and currently I'm working on uh, a cool project, and it's gonna be uh, the Latin culture because this um, this particular art show is called Creative Canvas, right? Okay. And they're very African American based. Okay. And mm. so uh, the you know the main guy Frank and and everyone else that runs it uh, usually run it off of Atlanta and okay. and. Uh, North uh, Carolina, like different spots, right? And they're very African American based, like a lot of African American art or uh, pop art or cultural art. And so it's dope, you know. It's like I love that. I support it a hundred percent because you're you're representing where you came from, what your roots and everything, mm -hmm. your culture, right? So um, no hate to that at all. And um, when they have other artists, they tend to fall in that timeline too because they want. I know they want to sell their paintings and they're looking at it as a monetary kind of way. Mm -hmm. For me, this time around, I used to do that, but in the sense that my art was more relatable in pop culture, right? So, uh, for instance, uh, if. Yeah, I was going to ask for Yeah, if, if, if a particular artist was uh, <laughs> famous at that time, that's what I would do. Oh, okay. Or if uh, a certain 
lifestyle was was in in trend so, at that time. The I trend, that. something trendy, yeah. right? So people would just be like, "Boom, that's what I feel like. That I love that. That's right. that's now. Let me buy it." Mm-hmm. And um, this time around, <clears throat> I'm doing a, a cool like cultural lifestyle kind of deal. So I'm Salvadorian. If you had to know that, okay. and um, you know, uh, a lot of people don't represent the Salvadoran culture very strongly because. Uh, it's misconstrued with the MS-13 and you know pupusas and all that like just the, we, we love yeah. so um, <laughs> and then people are like what, what's the culture about and there's not a lot of it uh, as far as that people can think of but I can like I mean um, I've been instilled that by my parents and I appreciate that because they're very like rooted so uh, this time around I'm thinking why not represent the whole Latino culture right right so um one painting that I'm working on that that I just finished is a, a Selena like painting that I did, but I made it into a loteria card. Mm. Oh, nice! Which is crazy because uh, they just had a, a Selena fest. Yeah, they in, did. Uh, 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 Miller up, yo, why not? Yeah. yeah. And so, um, so I did a a picture of her that no one has really like. It's not your common picture. Yeah. yeah. So you see the Selena from. Uh, from the Astrodome where right. she's wearing the, the purple, purple gear, suit, yeah. yeah. Or you see the ones where she's wearing the the white the, one too. The sparkle bra yeah. there with the hat. A bustier. Yeah. Okay, Jesse. All right, correct it me on that. Like that. It's okay. Not bra. Damn, bro, card <laughs> removal. <laughs> 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 yeah, like, it's a bustier. I'm out of this podcast room. <laughs> so the bustier with the hat, with the Ryan sounds, right? Yes. Um, so those are the pictures you see of Selena all the time, right? Right. Well, I did this like deep research and I was like, Selena, you know, it's like different pictures of her just like in her most natural habitat. And I found one of her. She has a hair slicked back and a ponytail and she's blowing this bubble gum, like the bubble, like That's just big, awesome. right? And it's, it's just a regular ass candid. You can tell it's taken with a fucking Polaroid and, and it was like basic flash no, I want to see it it wasn't it wasn't stage right yeah. and so I chose I was like you know what it may not it may or may not look like her because of the way it was shot whatever right. but this is something that she enjoyed as a candid so I made that particular image into nice. La Lama so I don't know if you've seen you know it's like I, I saw, I saw, yes, yes. It on, on yeah and I took it off right? and I took it off only because it was kind of like a teaser I don't want people to like resonate into it I want you to see it in person yeah. So, um, I made her La Dama, right? Because La Dama is like fancy, she was like sophisticated. Right. But at the same time, it's like, I want I to show you her. her, 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 her. her. How long did you keep it up? Uh, maybe social four or five days, maybe? No, maybe four I, days. I saw it one and day. then I took it off. Yeah. Oh, okay. um, I'm going to show y'all, but uh, the it. podcast no. itself. You know what we could do? You can send it, it to us, but I only put flash it on for like a second. Nah. I get the mentality. They don't get to get it. Look. Yeah. 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 Okay. So yeah, gotta go to the show. I get the mentality. To see go to the That's show right. to see it. All right. Well, it's, uh, August second. Where? Um, uh, I'll, I'll send. I'll give you all the info. Okay, so you okay, can, okay. I can share that. And currently, I'm working on this one. Okay. 